Hello guys, Jim on Touch here with another Minecraft 2D tutorial. This is part 22. I'm sorry if my voice sounds a bit weird, but I've been sick and all that. Um, this is, by the way, uh, gonna be my last tutorial until I'm gone. Um, I will be leaving the, my, my country for the night. Um, this night. Because I will be in Bosnia for like two or three weeks in Zarajevo, the capital city. And in this tutorial, uh, I wanted to show you how to create a falling sand and like a cactus and um, I've already uh, done the thing so I will just show you what I did and then you can copy it yourself um, so first thing you want to do is obviously add the sand and the sandstone sprite and the cactus sprite later we will be adding uh, dead bushes as well also what you want to do is you want to get a darker image of the sand and the sandstone sprite in our background sprite all right besides those sprites you need the three items of them so we got sand sandstone and cactus and of course in the hand of Steve you need to add those as well so I've added sand sandstone and our cactus sprite Great, so after you did that, we can get started. Uh, first is obviously the um, objects, so just create the objects, and um, I'll be uh, coming through this later. And the items, and we are just gonna count, so this was 17, so this is gonna be 18, 19, and 20. Um, this is what, I'm, what I mean 18, 19, 20. Okay, great. Now, you also don't want to forget to add the, the, these um, sprite variables, item variables, object variables, and I added this. Um, maybe we can do this later. It shows you what item you have selected, and you can draw uh, like this is cactus, you know, just in case you can't see. Uh, no, joke. But anyway, um, when we are uh, creating our uh, world of uh, desert we can just add a number like four here and I've added four so we can um, get uh, we get a uh, desert anyway always now uh, so just start a new thing desert here and we want to create the background already here because it isn't creating a background when we destroy a block because sand is falling down so the background object will always need a solid object and it will just uh, it will just disappear instantly from the um, it will not even be created from the object break so we can just add this behind everything there there and not for a stone the stone is already um, already created you can see that here see it's created in the alarm zero event so uh, the rest is basically the same as our plane biome, uh, the height variation is the same, um, the sand level, sandstone is a different thing, because we are like um, adding the sandstone level here, or I mean the sand level, so we can say sand here, sand level basically, uh, but we need to change that. So anyway, we say that, <coughs> I'm sorry, we say that it's alternate dirt level or sand level whatever is yy and the sandstone level is the um, is the level of the sand so the sandstone level is the level of the sand plus 32 multiplied by 1 2 or 3 so we get like a double layer um, where we will create sandstone and beneath sandstone we will create the normal stones so see, here we say sandstone instead of um, dirt stone level. Let's just create, let, let's just say this. This is so much, oh wow, that looks good. So sand level, looks better, right? And this is uh, alternate sand level. Um, this thing here is something different. Uh, we don't have dead bushes yet, so we will just uh, create cactus here. Uh, I will say here that the cactus height, so the global cactus height is uh, 
somewhere between one and three. I just did this. It looks nice. And the cacti, uh, cacti variable is uh, zero. And uh, where is it? And here the cactus level if uh, is plus equal one or two. It can choose. And if the cacti is higher than uh, 14, the variable cacti, and cacti is also lower than uh, 24, then it will just uh, set a variable 1 or 2, and if it's 1, then it will create a cactus. Generation, uh, minus 32, so the alternate height, minus 32, because uh, the origin of this uh, object it is in the left uh, top corner, so we say minus 32 and after that we say that cacti is choose between 0 and 5 so the rest is basically the same so now let's get to this object Ob object cactus gem what you want to do you want to create an empty object with no sprite no parent um, everything just a creation effect with some code and in here we say that if the global height, global cactus height basically is 1, 2 or 3. If it's 1 it will just create one ca um, cactus object. If it's 2 it will create 2 and if it's 3 then it will create 3 and after that it will be destroyed. It's really basic, really easy to do. So now the object cactus, it will just align by a grade of 32 by 32, same with the other objects. And in the um, uh, creation code we would just say this and if it's meeting a block then it will be destroyed because we can meet a block because of the um, align every every block has an align so and after that we say if place meeting a block so instance destroy then it's gone and um, we are going put, to put an alarm to 10 and in an alarm we will check this uh, this is basically the same with the other objects we will be creating, like uh, flowers and um, other other things like that, um, like the dead bush. Um, let me think. There are there there are more things. Grass, absolutely grass, is also gonna have something like this. And uh, alarm two is set to the, a random number here. And um, in alarm 2 we are gonna let the cactus grow to a certain height so uh, let's say there is a cactus created of one block then it can grow to four blocks high not high um, it's barren this solid block same with the other objects Okay, now this is the, the easiest object, object of all, object sandstone, it's just this, nothing else. Just 4 here, breaking is false, index 0, and this sandstone item as item. And uh, then we get to the sand, an object sand is a bit different, um, it, it looks like, it even looks like uh, this one, uh, not, not that one, this one. Um, Oh wait, yeah, it does. See, see that? Come on, go away. See this part here is almost the same. So sand is indeed affected by the gravity. Uh, by the way, I created this myself. It's just a note for myself. And the ver vertical speed, the horizontal speed, and if it's grounded or not. We we did this with Steve, right? And the gravity is zero because it's it's just a block. It's created and it can't fall down until this happens. If it's not meaning a block needed, and it is not meaning a ghost block, because if it falls on a torch, which which is a, go a ghost block, um, it will not fall through the torch. It will just um, fall on top of the torch. So just copy and paste this. Um, it's, it really looks like the object item, but then with just other variables. Collision. All right, and that is already already it. By the way, uh, yeah, 
that that's basically how you create falling sand the the trick is that you do this right and then then it will be fine so let me show you guys uh, now I get an error because I ref I started referring to the ASL alternate sand level and now I get some errors there so I would just change change it back to ADL oh wait I used it here ASL it'll be easier if I just say ADL it doesn't really matter all right so what happens if we destroy block under cactus it would just destroy because it is always checking if there is a block beneath it uh, we have a background with every sand a sand falls down um, I think that we only have a problem when we are below uh, sand so just go and check if we can do that uh, place a torch right here boom my torch is looking awesome but I don't uh, let's take one more down all right now this is gonna take some time oh cool okay great at the left side by the way is uh, the end of the world but um, yeah, I, I'm not sure how to how to get rooms yet, where you can just walk instantly without getting frame drops and things like that. So let's see. I I am now below sand. I'm behind sand. You can see my hands still there, and I can I can't move because yeah, well because we, we need to add that. And when I'm when I'm walking. Uh, to a cactus, nothing, nothing interesting happens. See, just me walking against the cactus. That's not cool. I want, I want, like, like this happens. Something like that. You know, you get a, get a bounce. Something like that. And with uh, HP and all that, um, that will be awesome. But we will do that later. Absolutely. Absolutely. Yeah. Wow, this is uh, pretty cool. Yeah, now we don't have that error uh, when we are creating sand like all the way up there, and there will be no no background there. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Uh, I hope you like this tutorial, and uh, make sure to like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you guys later. Peace out.